Okay, curtains have opened. Howdy, folks. This is Planetman1100. And coming. And today we're going to continue Undertale. First, click the yellow key fits perfectly into the slot. There are a bunch of VHSs. Seems like it's mostly cartoons of some kind. There are a bunch of VHSs. Seems like it's mostly cartoons of some kind. They seem to be alpha alphabetized. Save for a few stray sticky ones. Entry number four. I've been researching humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. I ended up snooping around the castle and found these weird tapes. I, feel, I don't feel like Asgore's watched them. I don't think he should. You wanna watch them? Might as well. There's a VHS player with a few tapes picked out beside it. They seem to be labeled in a specific order. Will you watch one? So there's gonna be uh, certain voices, familiar voices. You wanna voice them based on what what they sound like? I guess. I don't know what voices they're gonna be, but might as well. See? Alright. I don't know why I'm so tired. It's like 8 p.m. It's not even nighttime. It's noon. Uh, ugh, sorry about that. I had to yawn. Alright, tape one. Psst. Gory, wake up. Hmm? What is it, dear? Uh, and why do you have that video camera? Shush, I want to get to your reaction. Gory, dearest, what is my favorite vegetable? Hmm. Carrots, right? No, 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 my favorite vegetable is... And a mom. Get it? Go back to bed, dear. No, no, not yet. <laughs> now, if I were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? Hmm. I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would you be? I would be a Mamaranian. <laughs> ah, that's a good one. <laughs> you sure are excited to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, <clears throat> one day you could be a famous Marmedian. Well, I'm going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, come on, Tori. That one was funny. <laughs> I know. I'm just teasing you. Good night, dear. Good night, honey. Oh, dear. Perhaps it is too dark in here for the video to come out. That's probably a good thing. Choose a tape to watch. Tape two. Oh, I see what you mean now. Yeah. Okay, Nick. Are you ready? Do your creepy face. Ah! <laughs> oh, wait. I hit the lens cap on. What? You're not going to do it again? Come on, quit tricking me. <laughs> Choose a tape to watch. Wait, are all these going to be... Completely black? Yes. Aww. Yeah, it's kind of sad. I know. How 
Howdy, Nick. Smile for the camera. Ha! This time I got you. I left the cap on on purpose. Now you're smiling for no reason. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, I remember. When we were trying to make butterscotch pie for Dad, right? The recipe asks for cups of butter, but we accidentally put in buttercups instead. Yeah, those flowers got him really sick. I felt so bad. We made Mom really upset. I should have laughed it off, like you did. Um, anyway, where are you going with this? Huh? Turn off the camera? Okay. You know what they're gonna do now, right? What? Hopefully nothing bad? I... I don't like this idea, Nick. What? No, I'm not... Big kids don't cry. Yeah, you're right. No, I'd never doubt you, Nick. Never. It's kind of weird that they're using your name. Yeah. Y yeah, we'll be strong. We'll free everyone. I'll go get the flowers. Wait, are they going to... Nick, can you hear me? Excuse me. We want you to wake up. Nick, you have to stay determined. You can't give up. You are the future of humans and monsters. Nick, please wake up. I don't like this plan anymore. I... I... No. I said... I said I'd never doubt you. Six, right? We just have to get six. And we'll do it together, right? And that's the last tape. Remember when it said the human... ...became terribly ill? Yeah. Well... What? Oh, the fridge. I don't like that the fridge is shaking. Enter number 20. Ugh. Hasbro left me five messages to today. Four about everyone being angry. One about this cute teacup you found that looks like me. Thanks, Asgore. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. It's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some kind. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Entry number 21. I spend all my time at the garbage dump now. It's my element. It's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some kind. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. What? It said it was empty! It's so cold. Oh lord. Ugh. You know, I thought the other ones were absolutely terrifying, but this one's actually more sad than creepy. Yeah, this one's my least favorite because of how sad it is. Amalgamate. Snowy. Oh, even our attacks don't work right. Her? His attacks. How could you tell it was a female? I don't know. Or rather, how did you know it was a female? Because you just told me.
Amalgamate. Attack minus 12, defense minus 5. It seems like it's losing itself. They don't even do that much damage. Well, our attack did say minus 12. Laugh. You laugh and keep laughing. It's so funny, you can't stop. Tears run down your face. What? You didn't do that? Slowly. I kind of thought it was a hair based on your voice. Oh. Oh, because that's my feminine voice. You said something like, You look horrible. Why are you even alive? What? What? You didn't say that? Slowly. Oh, this is so sad. I'm actually not even afraid of this one. It's more like I'm depressed by it. You're depressed by it? You know what I mean. You told a bad pun about snow. Her expression starts to shift. I remember. It's so cold. You told a bad pun about snow. Her expression changes more. Better not snowflake out. <sighs> Thank you. It's so cold. Laugh, but it's not funny. Snowy. This is so sad. Call this a performance? Snowy. Why are you purposely hitting the things? It's too sad to let her not hit me. You told a bad pun about snow. She's completely calmed down. My favorite cereal is Frosted Flakes. Ah! <laughs> Frosted! That's a good one. Really, that's kind of sucked to me. Whatever. You won! You earned zero EXP and zero gold. And she dropped a blue key. You found a blue key on the ground. You put it on a keychain. Click! The green key fits perfectly into the slot. There's a note on the ground. You can't bang it all out. Curtain. That's all you can read. No wonder, because it's so dark down here. <laughs> that one actually got me a little. Oh yeah, we've already been here. All right, now to go back and uh... wait. Where was the blue door again? You forgot. Hang on, it'll come to me. Wait, now I remember. I think it's somewhere down here. Hopefully. Yes! Click. The blue key fits perfectly into the slot. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Cold. That's all you can do. Oh yeah, that's right. Where do 
your breath out. Oh, that's right, we got all the keys now, don't we? So we can head back. So let's go. I think I want to examine the beds first. Hey, eh. the rest of the beds. You could probably climb into it if you were to the left of it. It's a bed. It's a bed. It's just a regular suspicious bed now. It's a bed. Bed. It's a bed. It's a bed. It's a bed. Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Seems to be turned off. Seems to be turned off. Seems like this control is the elevator's power. Turn it on. No. I actually wasn't sure what those were at first, but... Those look like pipes. Now that I look at them. Yes, turn it on. Oh. oh no. No, 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 no. Someone please help us! Help! I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. Uh, anyway. The power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on. But it seems like you are one step ahead of me. This is probably just a big inconvenience for you. But, but I appreciate that you came here to back me up. Can we explain what those things were? Or what those guys were? As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I might... Or I was just worried I would be too afraid to tell the truth. That I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, I... I suppose I owe you an explanation. Yeah, you do. I should probably know... Oh, sorry, Kevin. That's fine. As you probably know, Asgore told me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated the power I called determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, humans is... Monsters' bodies don't have enough. Unlike humans, monsters. 
physical matter. Don't have enough physical matter to take those concentrations of determination. Their bodies started to melt and lost what phys physicality they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects had melted together into cells. Seeing them like this, I knew. I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it. No matter how much everyone was asking me. And I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing everything I'd done so far had been such a horrific failure. But now, now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard, being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times when I struggle, when I'll, when I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again, but knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on. I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Well then. we can just end it here so anyway that's gonna do it for this part but thank you all so much for watching this video hope you all enjoyed this just as much as uh, just as much as we did and hope to see you all again next time this is Planet Man 1100 and Kevin signing off <laughs>